Welcome, this is Tyson. Today I'm going to be writing a x86 assembly language program uh, to display Hello World. I know, super exciting, but here we go. I'm running this on uh, FreeDOS um, and a virtual box VM. So anyway, I'll be using a VI which is, comes with uh, Wat, OpenWatcom. And first thing, we'll, thing we're gonna to wanna to do is <clears throat> press I for insert. We're gonna define some includes. So for some functions that I have to make life a little easier. Two functions basically. One for exiting the application and one for writing a character to the screen. Because DOS has this weird um, interrupt called write character string to the console, but it's terminated with a dollar sign instead of a, a null character, which is kind of odd. So we're gonna be writing something that uh, doesn't use that. We're just gonna loop through the array and, and print out each character until we hit a, a null character. So next, we're gonna create our data segment, our code segment, code, and then our stack. We will define our stack as 512 bytes. 12 bytes. We'll create a label to find another byte. That's going to be an array. Terminate that with a zero, which is null. Put a nice space there. Define our starting uh, location for DOS, otherwise it'll complain. We we'll move our data segment into the AX address, and then move that into DS. We will OR out XOR AX, which is a apparently more efficient way of setting it to zero. Do the same thing with DI. We're going to create a loop label. Then we're going to move into AL our message address plus DI, which when we start out is going to be zero, so it's going to be the location of message. We're going to check AL for zero and jump if it's if the zero flag is set to end. We're going to push AX onto the stack. We'll call write. We're going to increment DI from jump to L1. To find our end, and we're going to call exit. Now, if I typed everything in correctly, this should just compile. And so far looks good. So we will write hello.a and then we'll quit. And hopefully it saved it. Hey, there it is. So we will build it. We have no errors. So let's go ahead and run the hello, see what happens. Nothing happens. Oh my. So let's go back and look at our, our program and see what I missed. Oh. 
That's so funny. Compare. Should be compare, not move. Hey, I was right. So you're probably wondering, maybe, what I'm using to build and link this. Well, in the previous directory, I have a batch file called build. I didn't use make because, frankly, I didn't want to spend the time to learn make. So it's a fairly simple batch file. Uh, we build our file with the bug symbols and if there's an error or not if there's no error then we run the link command which we're using Wacom link and it exits pretty simple and in the lib folder we are we have an exit function and a write function. Write is a little more involved in the exit because it um, pulls something off the stack and then returns. So there you have it, a little with some language program. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button Thank you.